Hi, you guys. So I'm here with my glossy box and boxy charm for Battle of the Boxes. So I don't have any clue at all, but I can tell you that both the boxes got some nice weight to them. So if that's a hint of a good box, I would say they're good boxes. But let's see. Okay, we're going to go for our glossy box first. All right, we got the typical pink box inside. It has a little Hello Fresh on here. It's $50 off your first two boxes. Oh, so that's basically $25 off one month or one shipping and then another one. But if you're interested in Hello Fresh, I got a nice Hello Fresh discount. And I think I might even have some free boxes. So I tried messaging some people that had messaged me on my old HelloFresh boxes, uh, box videos. They never responded. I think I have one, maybe two free boxes. If you're interested, you have to be first time users or first time orderers from HelloFresh. First two that message me, we'll get it. All right, into glossy box. Okay, it's sun kiss. This is nice. It doesn't have the tissue paper on top, which is fine. I don't know. Oh, it's there. It's underneath. <laughs> okay, so it says sun kiss glossy box. This is a really nice card this month. Forgive my nails, people, if you see it. I, I just, I'm asking in advance. Forgive me for that. I need to go get them done. All right, so let's open the paper up here. Ooh, this thing is packed full of stuff. There are so many items in the box in this particular box wow they're not huge items um i used to say that you know glossy box and boxy charm are very very comparable they are they're comparable in price but as for full size items boxy charm always has full size glossy box not so much it, they have they will have full size items but a lot of things will be deluxe size items um, and not little tiny samples. And if you get a little tiny sample, it's not really counted as part of the box. It's like an extra kind of a thing. So let's get into it. I'm gonna pull out the first thing here, which this pretty little um, cream, whatever this is, let's see. It says it's in a different language, so I have no idea. So I'm gonna have to refer to the little pamphlet that they have here, because I don't know what it says. Okay, it says from D. Breyer, Breuer, I don't know how to say that, after sun lotion. I actually love the scent, if that's what I'm correct, is Manoy, because I have body wash and hand creams um, with the name Manoy in it, and I absolutely love it. So let's just see. Oh yeah, this is, this smells really nice. It's very fresh. It definitely smells like the beach, it, but in not a coconut scent. It's tropical and just like kind of fresh and like clean scented. I like that. I'm gonna put that on my purse. Okay, and we have from Too Faced, this is the Mascara Melt Off. Cleansing Oil Waterproof Mascara Dissolver. Hmm. Interesting. I don't even know what that is. I guess it's like, um, you know, you put it on like mascara and then you leave it on for, it says 60 seconds and then you take it off. You know, I have a, um, oh yeah, cool. So it's just an oil in here. I like that. That's such a genius idea to be honest. I mean, I have an, I have Alme, um, eye, re eye removing, no, eye makeup removing wipes and they're awesome and I love it. And that's the only thing that takes off my eye makeup it, without having to rub really hard. It's like an oil kind of based one. And I I don't even think if they sell that type, that version anymore, but I have a whole bunch because I did a swap with um, Laura and, um, you know, we did a, I got a certain version that she liked and she got stuff that I like. So we just kind of swapped them out and switched with each other. I still have mine. I am very sparing with it. I use it all the time. I kind of, I know, don't blame me, but I use it more than one time. Like I'll use it one night and then the next night I'll flip the pad over and use the other side. It's my eyes, my germs. And we have hair rings, invisible bobble, the trackless hair ring. Hmm, interesting. So it's just, they look like little keychain thingies that you would normally wear. Like, you see that? That's for your hair? Huh. 
I would think that this would pull your hair a lot. I guess not. And this is from Borghese, Borghese, I don't know how you pronounce it. This is the Body Refining Polish. So it's an exfoliant. Ooh, I, you know, I can't stand the scent of their products. I really can't. I know it's a really nice brand. I just don't like the scent of their products. Like this smells like you get something, uh, it smells like it's coming from the spa. You know, if you like that kind of scent, then you'll probably like this. All right, the next thing in here is from Trifle Cosmetics, and it has like a little pug on it. <laughs> He's cute. What is this? It's a lip parfait. It doesn't say the shade. Oh, here. It says guilty pug. <laughs> cute. This is such cute packaging. This reminds me of Tarte packaging because Tarte has some of their packaging that's kind of like in a recyclable um, container. This lip color is really pretty. It's like an orangey kind of um, very neutral kind of orangey I don't know how you how would you describe that tell me how you would describe that I don't know but it's kind of reminds me of the packaging here not as orange but in the same kind of family and it's very creamy I put it on top of what I had but I already have like um, a long wear lip color underneath so I wasn't gonna take that one off but it's very creamy very nice and it has like it doesn't stink like you would think that something would come in this package would smell bad it has a little bit of a sweet scent like a tropical kind of sweet scent but not strong not strong at all uh, next we have in here this is from Wella this is oil reflections a smoothing oil um, and I actually I use hair oil all the time every day so oh that one smells nice so that'll be cool and I like that it has like a little pump like a you can squeeze out some of the serum or the oil and the last thing in here is from Savon Body Lotion, Delicate Jasmine. I think this is what leaked. The last time we got something like this in the box, it leaked also. But, mm, okay, it's just a very light, very, very, very light jasmine scent, which is good because this when it's really strong, it's too, too, too much. So there's everything in the box. You can see that was a ton of stuff in the box. This was a very nice box. A lot of um, a lot of things in there, which is always nice to get a lot of stuff. Okay, moving on to Boxy Charm. All right, it says Express Yourself right on the inside. Um, that's cool. I didn't see that before. Boxy Charm. Huh, interesting. I wonder, that's like perfect when you open the box, you can see it like that. I wonder if they designed that in mind of like people making videos and stuff like that. Cool. Unless it's just, you know, if you're looking at it, you could do that too. Everything is on the back of the card and I'll refer to it as we go. Um, we've got three, four, five things in here. I see a really nice thing on the bottom. I don't know what it is, but let's see. We're gonna go with this one here. Time Repair Serum um, from Aloe Pure Skin Care. Smooth away the appearance of lines and wrinkles with age-defying green tea extract and alpha and beta-hydroxy acids. Um, so you use it twice a day. Uh, this says that it's $48 for this one here. I believe that these little serums are always very pricey. So I'm excited to use this. This, I haven't used one that's like in a white, like a white cream serum. So yeah, I'm excited to try that one out. Next is from Beauty For Real. This is an all day, it's, it's called, I don't know if it's called, but it, the color is all day latte. Um, it's a shadow stick. So, hmm. I'm not a big fan of shadow sticks just because I don't know how to use them. That's it, plain and simple. This is a really pretty color. It's like burgundy, but purple. It's like a multi-tone kind of a thing. Let me see, what does this card say about this? Hmm, I wonder, somebody tell me how you use it. Do you just like paint it all over your eyelids and then you blend it out with a brush or your finger or something? Or do you just place it and like, maybe if I wanted to put this as like a, the outer corner, can I just put it there is it I don't know hmm all right it says uh, $19 paraben free and cruelty free long wearing cream to powder eyeshadow stick easy to apply and infuse with a meadow foam seed oil to moisturize rejuvenate and reduce signs of aging apply shadow to desired area and blend immediately you will only have about 15 seconds to blend as the color sets. It stays in place until removed. Hmm. Is that so? 
Oh yeah, hello. I put this on a couple seconds ago, not even a minute ago. Um, yeah, it's there. Huh, let me take a wipe and see if it comes off with a wipe. Ooh, it does, but it takes a little bit of work. Okay, so this is like an all day kind of wear item. Cool. This is a massive mascara container. This is huge. So it says Max Lash Volumizer. I'm all about the volume. Ooh, that brush. Let me see. Is it how I. Oh, yeah, it is. It's kind of like a weird. It's a very weird shape. It has a very strange kind of rectangular shape. I don't know. That's really weird. I wonder how that's going to apply. It looks like the brush itself looks like it's going to apply very well, so I'm curious. Um, this here, it says right on the side, dirty little secret. Um, and this is a velvet matte liquid lipstick. I already have like two layers of lipstick on already. And the color is in Phantom. It sounds like it's going to be really dark. Oh boy, I wasn't expecting that. It's like super bright orangey red. The packaging is really cute. And the red color underneath the see-through container with the white polka dots and the black packaging is really cute. And this lip color is Kapow Red. That's what I would have called it. I would have called it Kapow Red because this bad boy. Okay, let's wait for it to dry and we'll come back to this thing. Last thing in the box, awesome, from Coastal Scents. This is a blush and bronzer mini palette and brush combo. Oh, that's nice, it comes with a, a brush. It says $13.95 plus $6. Hmm. Let's see, let's open it. Ooh, nice, I like it already. See the colors there? Really nice. So that's nice, it comes with a little brush. I wonder if they're saying that the brush is $6. I wouldn't pay $6 for the brush. I would pay like a box. It's not the best brush. Um, the bristles are not very soft. They're kind of like um, like the fake feeling bris bristles. <laughs> My back hurts. <laughs> nice set. Um, the pink is very Barbie pinkish. They have the, the lighter pink one that's in here. Um, and then the deeper one is really nice. I think that'll look really pretty. Hopefully it's not very splotchy when putting it on. Um, this one right here, I don't know what the purpose of this middle one right here is. It's definitely not a highlighter because it doesn't have any shimmer or anything in there. And then these two bronzers here. Um, I think these will be really nice even as eyeshadows, these three right here. Very nice box this month from BoxyCharm. All right. Oh boy, you can see how this lip liquid lipstick has completely dried matte. And you see where it's still wet on the top and it's matte here. My fingernails growing out here, but. So both boxes are really nice this month. I'm really impressed with both of them. Um, the lip color, I can't wait to check out to see um, other shades that they may have from Dirty Little Secret. And it's very matte. I think if it's too matte, you can always put like a little gloss or something on top. And this box has such a variety of stuff that I can't wait to try out. Um, awesome boxes. Good job to both.